Hello everyone and welcome to part two of the trailer park challenge. I am B Bunny and if you're brand new to this I've got one video out so far uh, for this challenge basically just creating my sim Candace here. Uh, let's see if I can get her in the frame and uh, building her trailer. Uh, so this is actually the first video with uh, some gameplay here and you might be wondering why we are in the bar and that is because I actually recorded some gameplay and uh, did this first part already, or really part two, and I ended up crashing the game, or the game crashed on me. Uh, unfortunately, I had saved at this point, and I hadn't lost too much gameplay, and I had the footage, uh, so I was just going to edit it down and then continue on, but... It turned out that I had the audio mix all wrong for the footage, and there were times that you could barely hear me talking, and the game was way too loud. So, what I did is, uh, some of that footage was us uh, usable, and uh, I don't want you guys to miss out on the beginning of the story. So, I quickly cut together uh, what had happened so far, and I'm going to play that right now, and then we'll get back into the game. Here we are on the lot. Here is Candace Park. <laughs> She's so terrible. I'm sorry. I'm just getting distracted. I'm going to start her out on one of those part-time jobs, even though that's technically not a part of the challenge. Uh, technically, it's just uh, the culinary career and the gardening career and the criminal career uh, that you can do. But I think that's before they had these options of doing these kind of part-time starting out jobs. Um, so I was thinking uh, she could just start out as a fast food employee for right now, and then maybe uh, when she gets uh, through all three levels of that and has some skills, uh, we can move her over into the culinary career, and then that might be a little bit more realistic. So um, let's see. Let's have her work in the morning so she has her afternoons and evenings free to go hunting for a spouse <laughs> let's see when does she start she work oh my god she doesn't work for three days <laughs> oh <laughs> oh crap okay well and she can't make any money and we only have 250 dollars left after building the trailer I, as you can see i made just a couple of changes since the build i just added these awnings um uh, I really wanted to add them in the front too, but actually ran out of money uh, to do that. So she, oh, she's going to use her, her, her bush. Yeah. Look, you're not even pregnant yet and you're already throwing up? Really? What is going on? <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh goodness. Uh, in this save, I have not done the Strangerville uh, storyline. So, so, I guess we'll invite our neighbors in and try to talk to Leslie, even though, uh, uh, oh my god, they're all, <laughs> they're all infected. That's great. Oh my goodness, this is kind of creepy. <laughs> Um, but yeah, because I haven't done the, uh, the oh, but she still brought the fruit cake. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, we can't, we can't even talk to anybody, can we? Um, because they're all infected right now, so we can't even, this might make finding a, a spouse a little hard. Oh, look at her face. <laughs> Oh my God, welcome to Strangerville. Okay. <laughs> Let me see if we can get her to snap out of it. Maybe we can make a friend. Oh no. Oh, that did not work. Okay. Uh, I guess we'll try one more time. Oh, here we go. Oh, I guess I could just use the cheat mods to uh, cure the town. Um, or, you know, eventually it could be part of the storyline that... Uh, Oh, yeah, thanks for the mysterious plant there. I appreciate that. Uh, it could be part of the storyline that maybe one of her kids uh, goes and, and does the whole whole thing, especially if they're not going to be one of the heirs. Because um, we're going to have at least four kids. Oh, did they plant them? <laughs> I wonder if we're going to get a visit by the, uh, what, the Sims version of the FBI 
uh, and take away our fruit. Um, anyway, I'm going to go ahead and just cancel this because we're not getting anything. We're not getting to meet anybody. Join us in the crater. Yeah, we're not getting to meet anybody. And they're real creepy, so... I like, why can't I travel? Oh, I'm being investigated. <laughs> Wait. Oh, here they come. Here they come. We're being investigated. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Uh, traces of infection have been detected in your refrigerator. We have confiscated it and all of its contents. A refund has been issued for any inconvenience. Oh, hey, money. Oh, we got like $200. Thanks. Everything is within normal operating levels. Please abstain oh. from going near the secret lab and have a nice day. We are going to abstain because we are busy. We want to start a family and uh, have a whole bushel of kids. So that is what we're doing. Let's put this in your inventory and maybe I'll... I can't sell it, I don't think. I mean, I don't even know if it's worth any money. It's worth a dollar. <laughs> well, maybe I can sell it on the table. Oh, uh, we do our, our summer sale. Let's go to... Oh, well, at least we met them, even if we didn't get to talk to them. But let's just travel by ourselves, and we'll go to uh, the bar and uh, see who we meet here. Okay, great. So now we are back. We are at the bar. We're trying to get to know some of the people in the town and, and see if there are any uh, potential mates out here, potential spouses, because we need to get her pregnant ASAP. So this actually looks like one of the Secret Service agents <laughs> that visited her house and stole her strange plant, which is just fine. Um, Let's see, let's see, who's this guy? Military guy, so we know him. Let's see if he's single. He's single. <laughs> okay, come on. Let's see, let's see, let's meet some people. I don't know if we'll be able to really uh, develop a, a relationship. He is single, all right. I guess we can get with the military guy, although he will have to quit his job. If uh, if he turns out uh, to be our first <laughs> our first guy that we we rope into our, our oh he's a child of the ocean oh, oh that's great what are you doing out in the desert dude what are you doing here oh okay well I don't think we're gonna get with uh, uh, Judith Ward here <laughs> I don't think that's gonna be a possibility. Uh, I mean, I know with the Stranger Will storyline, this is supposed to be uh, uh, all the military people, but uh, so that's probably who we're going to meet, honestly, uh, is, is somebody in the army. Let's see, are you single? Let's see. Ah, uh, yes. Jay Lisa? Jay Lisa? Is that how you say her name? She is single. Let's, let's, let's see. Let's look, get to know you a little bit. See if we uh, spark. I assume you're in the military. I will ask about your career anyway. Oh my goodness. Okay. There is just so much talking here. Oh, why are we not talking to her anymore? What happened? What happened? She's, oh, it's guy's night, huh? Okay. Post about family. What family? You do not have a family yet. So, alright, well maybe we'll flirt. We'll see how this goes. Okay. Oh, no. Oh, oh, she's unflirty. Okay, well that did not go well. Oh, this guy's angry. Okay, well I, what are all these angry people doing here? I don't think we're going to have much of a chance to uh, have a good talk with uh, angry people. And yes, of course, this is where... Uh, El Faba would hang out when she's not doing magic. Oh, goodness. Who else can we? I mean, okay, we know he's married. Uh, maybe we can have an affair with <laughs> Jeffrey Landgraf. No, that doesn't that doesn't work. That's not part of the challenge because <laughs> they have to be married. So, all right. Well, she looks cute. She's a little bit, uh, a little bit of a cute little nerd. There we go. I guess. Uh. Oh gosh, I don't know what I'm talking about. Ah, okay. Oh, there she is. Okay, come on over. 
Oh no, she's really embarrassed. Oh goodness, from her awkward encounter with that unflirty Sim. Oh no. Why are you sitting over there if I told you to talk to her? Uh, okay, what about this guy then? I guess you... Are all the military people named Brendan? Maybe I should start doing flirty. Oh, you know what? Though she is feeling flirty. Oh, okay. This might be good. Well, we probably need to stop being embarrassed. I don't know if we're going to be able to uh, uh, actually <laughs> flirt successfully if we are. Oh, we're happy. Okay, good. Good. Okay, good. Phew. Okay. Let's let's uh, let's get to know. What's your name? Leanne, who is a scientist. Uh, part of the whole storyline. She's a child of the islands. What are all these island people doing here in the desert? <laughs> all right, that's fine. That's fine. Let's just get to know you. Come on. Come on. Oh, maybe we'll try. We'll try. Let's ask if she's sick. Let's ask if she's sick. Let's not, let's not go too far too fast. Let's just ask if she's single. Uh, why? Okay, good. You're going to actually look at her while you talk to her. That's nice. Uh, okay, Leanne is single, and she's feeling flirty. I really think that we should maybe go for this. Um, I think in the footage, it didn't quite pick that up, but uh, if we end up uh, with... Uh, Oh, no, no, no. Oh, God, we suck at this. <laughs> we are horrible. We are not good flirters. She's like, I am going to get a drink. I cannot take all this rejection. Oh, oh gosh, she is hungry, and she's getting tired, so we might should go home. Uh, oh, the bartender left, even. We can't even get a drink. Well, here's a new bartender, but I, you know what? I think maybe let's look and see. I mean, we've met a lot of different people. What we might do is kind of invite them over to the trailer uh, and see if we can maybe feel a little bit more confident on our home turf. So, yes, all the celebrities just hang out. Oh, great. Great. There's a lot, too. All right. Let's go home. Let's go home. We don't need to hang out with the celebrities in the vlog. It's time. It's time to get it. Get out of here. Okay. Oh goodness. Oh, that's right. She's gonna walk all the way through this trailer park again. Okay. Let's just get. Let's just get back to our own trailer and. Oh, maybe we can start over tomorrow. Um. Oh, here is another thing. <laughs> I think you saw in that recap, I got so excited about the $200 that I got from the secret agents and uh, just totally did not realize that they took my fridge. I mean, I knew they did, but for some reason I didn't put it together that it took my fridge and they took the coffee maker because I had that little fridge and the coffee maker was on top of the fridge. So let's have some of this delicious fruit cake, please. And oh God, she's embarrassed. She's hungry. Oh, and she's feeling angry. Well, girl, I know you had a tough time at the bar. I, I do not blame you uh, for being angry and embarrassed. Oh, poor Candace. I'm so sorry. If it makes you feel any better, I suck at flirting too. Uh, so yeah, we're, we're, we're both pretty, pretty terrible about it. <laughs> so I do actually uh, need to get her a fridge. I mean, I guess it's not completely necessary just yet because she does have the fruitcake she can eat and as long as she likes the fruitcake and it doesn't give her a negative moodlet uh, it might be okay and might be okay either but I'm gonna try oh yeah see we only got $200 and our fridge was $250 and I don't know if we're gonna get the coffee maker just yet either <sighs> but that's how much is the coffee maker? Oh, it's only 50 bucks. Okay, well, you know, she doesn't work for, I had a blue before, maybe we should get a pink one. I like the pink one, let's get the pink one. All right, so terrible coffee coming up. Uh, so yeah, now we only have 191 simoleons left and 
we might have bills tomorrow. I'm not sure. And we moved it on a Sunday, so I, I'm not sure if we're going to have bills tomorrow or not, or if it's going to wait, if the game is going to give us a week to get some money together, because I'm a little worried about uh, what the bills are going to be. We don't quite know yet. Uh, so, okay. all right, you're all done. Let's, let's, oh no, you hate the fruitcake. Oh, well, that sucks. That sucks. Let's take a bubble bath. Let's take a bath before we relax and go to bed. Um, well, I'll just clean this up for you. That would be nice. I won't always do that though, especially when the challenge goes, because, you know, uh, things are probably going to get messy around here, I can imagine, especially since she's a lazy sim. So, all right, we'll go to sleep after this. Oh, goodness. Uh, I guess we should assign this bed to her, too. Uh, yeah, just just for now. Um, even though her future kids may end up sleeping in it. <laughs> so, yeah, so I was thinking I might... One of the things I'm thinking would be okay would be since she has this part-time job to, to go ahead and let her do some odd jobs to make some money on the side. I, you know, I'm not sure if that's technically within this uh, spirit challenge or not. I mean, she's not getting money from nothing. And I know that that's one of the things like you can't just sell paintings and um, sell collectibles, go around and, and, and sell collectibles. It is pretty easy to, okay, I think you need to get up girl. I think it's, it's getting to be kind of bad. You need to, uh, I guess I'll have you make something since you don't like this fruit cake. So we'll, we'll make some breakfast this morning. Um, so I guess I'm still trying to decide if that would be okay. I mean, I think so. Like I, maybe it depends on what kind of odd job it is. Like, you know, something that she actually either has to accomplish. Well, I guess she just goes to work and goes down a, a rabbit hole or not a really a rabbit hole, but just disappears off the lot, goes to work and, um, oh, uh, eggs and toast. Okay. Let's have some eggs and toast. $4. Uh, four simoleons. Ah, <laughs> we're already, we're already a little worried about, about our money. Oh goodness. Um, uh, which is how, how it should be. But I mean, yeah, she really does need to find a partner and uh whether i'm not going to discriminate gender wise whoever she ends up with um i'm probably going to just edit them and, and cast and uh make sure that they can get her pregnant uh since adoptions don't count in the challenge uh she actually has to be oh god i hate that noise uh okay because <laughs> she's terrible at cooking so of course oh my god look at her go oh she's terrible um uh, Anyway, uh, whoever she ends up with, I'm not, I, we're equal opportunity, uh, here. She can, oh no, no, God, no, what do we do? Okay, wait, wait, wait. She is in, on fire. Can she, no, no, why is it the alarm? Oh my God, is she going to die? Is she going to die right now? Is this, is this challenge going to be over? Oh, she should start thinking about university while she's on fire. Why can't I run? Why can't I go anywhere? Oh no, get, oh no. Can somebody come help me? Oh no, she is dying. Oh my God. Can I, wait, wait, wait. Extinguish self. I don't know why I'm just sitting here panicking. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God, this is terrible. Oh my God. Okay, okay. You're just gonna have to eat some fruitcake right now. I wish she was going to. I can't believe I nearly just like forgot she could extinguish herself and I almost just killed the sim before we even started and she's like this look I've been on fire I smell terrible and you're forcing me to eat this terrible fruit cake oh my god and we got another two hundred dollars but this is probably replaced four hundred dollars we can't afford this oh oh my god this is terrible this is terrible oh <laughs> all right well we just made this a much harder challenge on ourselves now let's take a bubble bath we deserve a bubble bath right now oh my god oh my gosh well nice thing is uh we do have a fire pit out here let's see we do have what, a fire pit uh, so we could kind of roast hot dogs and 
Oh, and we've got these bees. Oh my gosh, I forgot about the bees. I was gonna like collect the honey to sell on the table, but I guess if we had to, she could eat the honey. And we can make salads and, and have quick meals because the fridge is there. The fridge is fine. We just don't have a stove and, and one of the, I'll replace a hundred dollars. I guess I'll just go ahead and replace that. And then we'll just have to save up money for the, for a stove. Oh, great. Here comes another. <laughs> oh, okay. She's gone. Okay. Oh, oh my God. I cannot believe that just happened. Oh, okay. Well, let's, um, all right. I think, I guess, I think we should definitely do an odd job because she's not working until Wednesday and it's Monday. Uh, I think it, I think it'll be okay since she has a part-time job. I think it'll be okay if she just looks and sees if there's something that she can do to try to <laughs> get a stove. And then we absolutely have to uh, get a partner uh, and get a spouse uh, so we can get pregnant and get married and get going on this. So um, let's see here. Work. Okay. Find our jobs. Oh, I swear. Ugh. I think that is the first time I have set a sim on fire in The Sims 4. Like, actually, literally. I mean, I've had fires uh, before, but I think this is the first time uh, I have set a sim on fire. <laughs> and then, I, that's why I didn't know. I, that's how you say For some reason, I was thinking she needed to get in the bath or, or jump in a pool. I knew there's a pool around. Uh, and uh, I, I did not realize that you could click on yourself and extinguish yourself. And, uh, whoo, okay, we survived. That's the important thing. We survived. Okay, photography level one. We have no photography skill. Fishing level three. We have no fishing skill. Handiness level four. Cooking level one. Well, <laughs> we just got 27 minutes. Oh, we would have to find a... We'd have to go to the island and go to one of those, like, pits, uh, barbecue, pit, volcano barbecue pit things. I don't want to do that. Hiking buddy, no. Oh, beach clean buddy. We still have to go to the beach, though. I don't know. I don't know if she could get to the beach, really, if that's, you know, if that's really realistic. Um... Yeah, that's kind of, I guess we could do this photography thing. Okay, looking, oh no, we still have to go to the beach, right? We can't just take a picture of, of, of StrangerVille. Oh, well, I don't know if any of these are going to be anything she can do. I guess we are just going to have to survive without, uh, yeah, I think we're just going to have to survive without this right now because I don't think she she has the um, resources to get to the beach. Like, I don't think that would be super realistic uh, to get to Solani uh, from this point. So I guess we're going to concentrate on finding a spouse. And I think instead of like going somewhere, I wonder if we can, okay, well, Leanne kind of rejected her. And what was the other person that rejected her to? that was unflirty. So we definitely don't want to invite them over. I guess let's invite over, let's invite over Brendan. Let's see. We don't know him, but yeah, let's see. Let's see if he'll come over and maybe we can, oh, we want a woohoo in the bush. Maybe we can woohoo in the bush. Woohoo in our poo woo woo poo bush. Oh, he says coming over. Just coming over. We've got a chance. All right, here we go. Here we go. Let's see if we can deep conversation ourselves into this guy's pants. I uh, might get in trouble with that. Okay. Hi. Can we invite him in? No, we're just gonna. Oh, is he gonna go not? What are you doing? Are you angry? Oh, dude, not cool. Hey, can we scavenge for parts? No, okay. 
dude, what the, what the hell? No. All right. We are going to be yelling at him. Oh, no, we're going to wave nicely. No, he knocked over our truck. I think he's complaining about it. Are you serious? Are you serious, dude? I am not, oh, but you're not. Uh -uh. No, we're yelling at this dude. Why are you going to watch TV? Let's yell at him. Why are you going to watch TV? Get back here and yell at this dude. He came over. He knocked over our trash can and then complained about the own mess he made. Yeah, you know, I just lost a ton of simoleons in this fire. And you, no, I'm not going to apologize. I'm going to mock your outfit. <laughs> I mean, we're hot headed anyway, right? So, yes, let's mock your earrings and your outfit. I don't know. Guy earrings are fine for me, but I just, maybe she doesn't like them. Maybe she thinks. Let's slap him silly. He's very angry now, but you know what? And he does not like us. I think we should just ask him to leave. Yes, let's slap him. This was... <laughs> oh, well, he laughed at it. Okay, well, that's that wasn't a mean slap. That was a playful slap. Can we just ask him to leave? Uh, go away. But he might not actually leave from that. Uh, oh, he's just like stomping off. Uh, I think we just have to say goodbye. Unless, unless he did. No. Oh, you're not going to let, he's just going to ask, he's going to stand at the edge of our property. Hmm. I mean, we should say goodbye. No, what are you doing now? Are you going to clean up this trash? No, you're just going to stomp in it? Oh my God. And he just made more trash. Okay, well, thank you for picking up my trash can. But I, I really think you should get out. I think you should get out. Can we ask him? him to leave? <sighs> Are we just say goodbye? That's all we can do? No. No, we can't ask him to leave? <laughs> Is he just here? He's just talking to himself? Oh my gosh. I'm sorry. I'm not even with her. What are you doing? What are you doing, girl? Ah, uh, eating your fruitcake. Look at, oh my God, she just looks miserable. I mean, we've had a really, really hard day. Oh, it's sad. That's sad. We've had a really hard day. Oh my gosh. Let's take a picture. Okay. Oh my goodness. We've had a really hard day. I wonder if I should leave. We could try one more. Let's let's try someone else. Let's try to invite. All right. Well, Leanne rejected us, but maybe if we got to know her a bit more before we tried a pickup line, maybe that was just too much too soon and we can get to know her. All right, she is coming over. All right, let's go. Let's go find her. Let's go get in a place where we can see her when she gets here. This guy's still talking to our trash can. He probably wasn't the best choice of future husband. Why are you still here? Just leave, dude. We don't like you. We don't like you, and I can't ask you to leave. I don't know why. I can ask her to leave. Oh, my gosh. Can we just complain about our problems? That's probably not very... Uh, <laughs> oh, wait, where? Ah. Oh, yes, let's wave to each other in different rooms. Okay. Let's, oh, we're just having some problems. I mean, this is not very attractive just to complain right off. Like, yeah, she's just like, whatever. Just like, listen, I don't like cloudy weather, but you don't hear me complaining about it, do you? Funnily, that was a plus interaction. <laughs> We'll just chat on our front porch here. Oh, goodness. Oh, goodness. See, she's romantic. Why are we not getting along? She's romantic. She was flirty at the bar. What's up? Maybe she's just one of those people that, like, has a really hard shell, and you, you've got to really, like, kind of get to know her to uh, kind of get any kind of uh, vulnerability or intimacy. <laughs> All right, so we'll just, we'll, we'll stick with, oh, we can have a deep conversation. Well, why don't we tell an engaging story? Look, we're a cool girl. Let me tell you the story. I don't know, nothing's happening. Yeah, I would tell a story about how I got, caught myself on fire cooking some eggs. 
And doesn't that happen to you guys all the time? Like cooking some eggs and toast and you set your whole stove on fire and yourself on fire. It's just so typical. Oh, the Hey, can you leave? Look, you're still mad. Why can't you leave? Ask to leave. Thank you. Thank you. I don't know why I couldn't do that before. You're I hope, she, I hope it doesn't. Hello, Sneeb. Oh, he's acting shocked. Like, how dare you? How dare you ask me to leave? <gasps> hey, so do you have a career? Because if you move in with me, you're going to have to quit. Oh, goodness. Oh, someone invited me to the humor. Oh, I missed it. Oh, that's right. She's a scientist. Okay. I don't think that's an actual career. Like, if we actually... Okay, we're going to go clean up the trash. That's fine. You're uncomfortable right now, too, so you're probably not going to get anywhere. Uh, all right. Well, I think I am I'm going to try a little bit more. Why didn't you just put it in this trash can out here? Okay. I'm going to try to build up my relationship with Leanne a bit more and see if we can. Let's have a deep conversation. Just while we're, until this uncomfortable feeling goes away. I don't think trying to flirt while you're uncomfortable is the best thing, so. <sighs> I mean, she's asking her about science. Maybe we'll lie about our own career just a little bit. <laughs> we don't want to admit that we are a table cleaner at a fast food restaurant in Strangerville. Okay. See. Oh, we should have told the dramatic story. Is that still there? Uh, yes, because we have a very dramatic story to tell. Oh my gosh, it was like an explosion. Oh, I was on fire. It was very dramatic. I know I told you the story already, but it just happened, and I really can't stop talking about it. It, it was a big thing. It was a big deal. So, how was your day? <laughs> All right, where where are we? We're not friends yet, but we're getting there. Our green bar is going up a little bit, so maybe maybe we should ask to swing with. Maybe we could go swinging and see. That might be cute. Maybe we can bond over swinging on the swing set. Is she not coming? She's she's not coming. Really? You not coming? Or did she go out the other way? Wait. Oh, she did. <laughs> okay. That's good. Okay. Oh, do they chat while they're swinging? I don't know if I've ever... Yeah. Oh, at least, hey, yeah, they're being friends. Oh, it's getting their friendship up. Yay. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I understand you're still friends, but let's... Uh, we've asked about her day like so many times. No, don't go. Don't go into the. Let's just discuss some interests. Let's get to know her a little bit better while she's swinging. Argue about politics. No, thank you. Hey, maybe we should tell some jokes. No, we can't. Oh, we are feeling very uncomfortable. Oh, great. Great. Girl, you're not pregnant. You're not pregnant. You actually have to woohoo first before you can get pregnant oh, goodness. okay you know let's let's well we can still tell a joke about vampires we can still tell a joke about vampires whoops i love how every joke is that <laughs> okay Okay, yeah, ask to hang out. I guess she was about to leave. Okay, we don't want her to leave. We're trying. I think we're getting good. We're getting good. Our friendship's going up. Oh, we can even hug. Should we hug? Should we hug? Yes, take a picture of the hug. Just in case this turns out to be the one. Just in case, Leanne gonna help us start our family 
okay. I think we should try to flirt a little bit. Let's try to flirt a little bit. Let's take the chance. Yeah. Oh, we're tense. Ah, crap. That did not go well, did it? No. No. Oh, this might not work. Leanne might not be the one for us. I don't think she likes us. I don't think she likes us like that. It's so sad. All right, Leanne. I'm giving up. Let's, oh, we both want to go. We both want to go to the mirror. <laughs> Give ourselves a little pep talk. Oh, my goodness. Okay. I think. I know. I know. Why don't you. Uh, I was going to say cook a little dinner, but. <laughs> let's. um. How about let's make a family sized garden salad? And then if Leanne wants to eat, she can eat. But otherwise, I think we're going to have to give up on her. I think, don't think she's the right, the right sim for us, unfortunately. All right. Well, I think I'm going to go ahead and leave this part here. And hopefully next time we'll have a bit more luck and, and, and meet, and meet someone so we can get going as we really do need to get started on these pregnancies. I have my lifespan at normal, uh, so we don't have a huge amount of time to get through four pregnancies and uh, uh, and, and raise up some kids and uh, start the next generation. Oh, that's, that's, that's a lovely little addition to your salad there. Candace, that's lovely. Uh, so hopefully we will have better luck next time. <laughs> I want to thank you guys for watching and if you have any feedback or ideas or anything uh, you want to see uh, feel free to comment below or just comment below and say hi. Uh, I hope everyone is having a great day and I will be back soon.